Well, turn me up. All right, so why are you, rec why are you becoming a recording artist? Um, I'm becoming a recording artist to show the world that I got talent of uh, rapping and to put myself out there and make some money. Do you have any music influences? Um, I listen to Young Boy and Fred Bain. Um, I don't really look up to nobody to be nobody. I want to be myself. So you basically trying to open your own lane of music, basically. Yeah, really. So you listen to Fred O'Bang and Youngboy. They more like of a, you know what I'm saying? They more of a street artist. Is that your type of music you make, like street music? Um, I'm going to talk about everything street music because I have been through some stuff myself. And love music, heartbreak music. I want to talk about it all. Not just street music, though. How long you been doing music? Since like 12, middle school, I've been writing uh, music with my dad. He taught me. Do your dad record music himself? Yeah, he does. So you've been writing since you was 12. Have you recorded anything? Yeah, I've been in the studio a couple times. I recorded some stuff. I got like 25 songs on my phone that... I just recorded on my phone, so they're not really much, but I've been like perfecting myself here and there. So where your um real rap name come from? Um, I just made it up. My name started with a K. You feel me? Kilo. I just think that's that's tight. So Kilo. All right, so. You have 25 songs on your phone, you said. Yeah. Are you planning on recording any? Um, I plan on doing some over, definitely. Um, I, would, I recorded them on an app called BandLab. So you record through your phone, through um, your headphones. So I plan on, you know, doing some over. Do you know where you record? You going to record your music at? Mm, not right now. Name, name a few things that, like studio necessities like name three things you have to have when you're in the studio a blunt <laughs> my phone um three some money so a blunt phone and some money is gonna get you in your mood yeah you mentioned your phone. Do you like write your lyrics in your phone or you like do it on notepad? Yeah, I do it on notes in the phone. As I listen to the song, like I said, I only take like one time to listen to the song and I already have something. I can write pretty quick. And what's the quickest you ever made a song in? Like 10 minutes. 10 minutes, that is pretty quick. Yeah. All right, so um, what you think about the Indianapolis music scene right now? Like, you a fresh artist. I know that, you know what I'm saying, you just now getting started, but I'm pretty sure you, you listen to, well, I don't know if you listen to them or not, but I'm pretty sure you know locals around. Yeah. So what do you think about the Indianapolis music scene right now? Um, I think it's cool. Like, it's just that. Like, I feel like it just needs something to spark up. Something new, something that's gonna put everybody on. Cause right now it's just kind of silent. So like, what you think is missing? Like just something, like a real talent, not just mediocre stuff, not just something you can dance to. So do you feel like it's a lack of support in the city for like artists? Yeah, Nap Town. That's all they do. They really hate. They don't support. Is there any locals you want to work with? Yeah, King Dre and Lil Money. King Dre and Lil Money. Yeah. That's it? For now. Okay. All right, so you mentioned you got 25 songs. You plan on recording some. Are you working on like a, a project or? Yeah, I'm going to be working on my album. You dropping the album when? Yeah, on February. February. You have a name for it? Kilo. It's a self-name and title? Yeah. 
That's a good idea. Well, turn me up.